A frozen giant in the Southern Ocean is breaking apart and scientists say it may soon vanish entirely. A silent giant named A23A is navigating the vast waters of the Southern Ocean. More than just an iceberg, it is a floating mountain of ancient ice, a colossal slab of the Antarctic continent that has broken away. With an estimated weight of 1 trillion tons, this ghost from another era is now drifting on an unstoppable journey. At roughly 4,000 square kilometers, it is comparable in size to the Indian state of Kerala, or more than twice the size of Greater London, making it easily visible from space. It was once the size of a small country and twice as large as London, after drifting through the world's oceans for nearly 40 years. Now it is on course toward one of the planet's most precious wildlife sanctuaries. South Georgia, a remote British island territory teeming with seals, penguins, and rare seabirds, now lies directly in the path of this icy behemoth. The world's largest iceberg is on a potential collision path, depending on winds and currents, with one of Earth's most fragile ecosystems, raising a critical question. What happens when these two forces of nature meet? The story of A23A is more than just a tale of melting ice. It is a reflection of a changing planet. The story of A23A, often called the Queen of Icebergs, began long before its current journey. In 1986, this massive piece of ice, one of the oldest of its kind, carved from Antarctica's Filchner Ronner ice shelf. At the moment of its birth, it was even larger, but instead of drifting out into the open ocean, its immense weight caused it to run aground on the sea floor. There it remained, frozen in place for more than three decades, a silent, motionless giant. During this long period of dormancy, it even carried a piece of human history on its back. The Soviet research base Druzhnaya Vorst ended up on the iceberg after carving when it broke away, prompting a complex rescue mission the following year. While most icebergs of its kind fracture and melt away within a few years, A23A endured, earning its title as the world's largest iceberg, not just for its size, but for its sheer persistence. For 34 years, A23A was a fixed feature on satellite maps, a frozen island pinned to the ocean floor by its own colossal mass. But in 2020, after decades of stillness, something fundamental shifted. The giant began to stir. Slowly at first, and then with gathering momentum, it broke free from the seabed and began to drift. Ocean currents had finally loosened the grip that had held it captive for a generation. The sleeping beast was awake and on the move. This awakening marked the beginning of an extraordinary journey that captured the attention of scientists worldwide. By November 2023, A23A had traveled north, passing the tip of the Antarctic Peninsula. A month later, the British research vessel, RRS Sir David Attenborough, intercepted it in open water. The ship's crew spent hours navigating alongside just a fraction of its towering ice cliffs, providing a breathtaking perspective of its scale. Researchers aboard seized the rare opportunity to collect water samples, hoping to analyze the nutrients the melting giant was releasing into the ocean. Then, in January 2024, drone footage revealed a stunning sight. Enormous archways and caves carved into the iceberg's walls by the relentless action of the waves. These surreal images offered the world a glimpse of nature's sculptural power, transforming A23A from a static relic into a dynamic and evolving entity. Once free, A23A was propelled by some of the most powerful forces in the ocean. It entered a notorious stretch of water known as Iceberg Alley, a corridor where many massive icebergs are torn apart by turbulent currents. Yet A23A remained largely intact, it was soon caught in the grip of the Antarctic Circumpolar Current, a powerful oceanic river that circles the continent and pulls icebergs northward into warmer waters. Its journey saw another significant pause in 2024, when it became temporarily trapped in an oceanic whirlpool over an underwater mountain. For nearly eight months, it spun slowly in place, caught in this natural ocean trap, but it eventually broke free once more. By early 2025, after traveling over 3,000 kilometers, the ice giant was just a few hundred miles from its next potential destination, the remote island of South Georgia.
It had found its path, and nothing appeared capable of stopping it. Far from the bustling ports of the modern world, South Georgia is a remote and rugged outpost in the South Atlantic. The island, about 170 kilometers long, is a fortress of steep mountains and sprawling glaciers, a landscape forged by ice and wind. This is not a place designed for humans, it is a wildlife sanctuary. Threatening to disrupt lives of millions of penguins and seals that call it home. The island is one of the most vital breeding grounds on the planet for seabirds and marine mammals. Its beaches are crowded with millions of king penguins, and its rocky shores are home to massive colonies of fur seals. In the skies above, albatrosses and petrels soar on the perpetual winds. This unique ecosystem, which has thrived in isolation for millennia, now faces a threat of unprecedented scale. A 23A is approaching, and its arrival could disrupt the delicate balance that sustains this incredible abundance of life. The animals that depend on this sanctuary have nowhere else to go. When a floating city of ice meets a fragile ecosystem, the consequences can be devastating. A 23A poses a direct and severe physical threat to the wildlife of South Georgia. If the iceberg grounds in the shallow coastal waters, it could create a massive wall blocking access to the ocean for countless penguins and seals. This would be particularly catastrophic during the breeding season, when parents must make frequent trips to the sea to forage for food for their young. Chicks and pups could starve as their parents are forced to travel much longer distances around the colossal obstacle. Beyond the surface, the iceberg's sheer weight could scour the seabed, destroying delicate marine habitats that are home to cold water corals, sponges, and other organisms that form the foundation of the local food web. At its immense size, a 23A is large enough to alter local ocean currents, affect water temperatures, and even influence regional weather patterns. The threat is not just a single moment of impact, but a long-term disruption that could ripple through the ecosystem for years to come. While the carving of A23A in 1986 was a natural event, born in 1986 when it broke off Antarctica, A23A promptly got stuck on the ocean floor for more than 30 years. Its current journey is unfolding in a world that is fundamentally different. Scientists often draw a parallel to wildfires. Fires are a natural part of many ecosystems, but climate change has dramatically increased their frequency and intensity. The same can be said for the loss of Antarctic ice. The planet is warmer, and its oceans are absorbing the vast majority of that excess heat. This warming is altering the natural rhythm of Antarctica's ice shelves. Warmer ocean water is seeping beneath them, melting them from below and weakening the points that anchor them to the continent. As a result, giant icebergs are breaking away more frequently and moving faster into warmer latitudes. A 23A is a powerful symbol of this new reality. It is a natural phenomenon, but its journey is being amplified by the unnatural warming of our planet, a tangible reminder that the consequences of climate change are already in motion. For scientists, a 23A represents both a looming threat and an unparalleled scientific opportunity. It is exceedingly rare to study an iceberg of this magnitude up close, especially one that is so active. The expedition of the RRS Sir David Attenborough was a moment of profound discovery, allowing researchers to gather data from the iceberg's immediate vicinity. A primary focus of this research is the mineral dust embedded within the ice. As A23A melts, it is expected to release a rich cocktail of nutrients, such as iron, that have been locked away for thousands of years. These minerals act as a natural fertilizer for the ocean, potentially, potentially triggering blooms of phytoplankton. These microscopic organisms are the foundation of the entire marine food web and play a crucial role in absorbing carbon dioxide from the atmosphere. In this sense, a23A is a giant floating laboratory, offering critical insights into the complex connections between ice, the ocean, and the global climate. While the ecological impact is the primary concern, an iceberg of this size also presents a tangible risk to human activities. As A23A drifts north, it moves closer to established global shipping routes. 
A collision between a commercial vessel and a floating mountain of ice could be dangerous. Modern ships are equipped with advanced satellite and radar systems to detect such hazards, but the iceberg's unpredictable path requires constant monitoring and forces vessels to reroute, adding time, cost, and risk to their journeys. It is a stark reminder of nature's enduring power in an age of technology. Yet the story of A23A is filled with paradox. Even as it threatens one of the world's richest ecosystems, its melting is also a source of life. The nutrients it releases will support new growth far out in the open ocean. It is simultaneously a destructive force and a life-giving one, a warning about our planet's future and a source of natural wonder.